Hello! I want to show you a really fun eyeshadow look that a friend of mine um, actually showed just the other day and I thought it looked so pretty that I wanted to share it with you guys. So just some full disclosure what's happening in the background here. My husband's working outside. You're going to hear a saw probably going off and I have four kids around. But this makeup is so easy and so doable that anyone can do it even if you're at home alone with your children. <laughs> And you have four of them like me so as you can see i did my hack um i did really i just did basic colors i did frenchy underneath my eyes on my cheeks on my lips um and then i did my main um my ash for my contour i did amber and aura for my highlight and that's it i said it was some setting powder and i used a little bit of georgia illuminator on my cheeks you can see it right there georgia is so pretty um, okay, so now I'm going to go in and I'm going to do my eyebrows. And so I'm going to show you today how you can use actually eyeshadow to do your brows. So I'm going to use a color today called Bird and I'm using my multitasker brush. Okay, and all I'm doing is I'm just filling them in a little bit. So if you do not know if it's worth it to do your brows, I'm telling you ladies, it so is. So you can do your brows a couple of different ways. You can use your contour that comes with your, when we give you your color match or... You can use eyeshadow. Look at the difference between my two eyebrows. And because I used eyeshadow, you don't really need to comb it out. However, if you want to take that extra step and comb your brows, you can use our hotline brush and just make those lash, make those uh, eyebrows behave. And so when you're doing your brows, you want to look where your eye is ending and you want to make that line kind of line up. And then I'm just filling in all the way out and then it kind of is going to peak there do you see where it peaks and then it naturally tapers out that's where you're going to start angling down and out super easy you guys it's like the easiest thing to do your brows okay the next thing i'm going to do is i'm going to prime my eyelids so that my eyeshadow stays all day you guys um there's multiple ways you can do this you can buy an eyeshadow primer from anywhere from walmart from sephora um, for MAC, whatever you like, you can use your highlight color or you can use your contour. So today is a day that I'm using my contour color. Okay. So there's my contour. Um, and then I'm going to go into my eyeshadow look, which I'm super excited about. I'm going to show you using just this one brush you need. This is the one brush you need for your eyeshadow. It's called the eyeshadow everything. If you do not have it, it is totally worth your investment. And the colors I'm going to use today are Valencia, Tawanda, Bird. So the same color that I used on my eyebrows, I'm going to use for my eyeshadow, Bird, and Trust. You ready for this? So I'm going to start with a fluffier. I'm just going to clean off my brush on my quick here. I'm going to start with a fluffier end of my brush, and I'm going to go with Sabrina. Did I say Sabrina before? I'm going to go with Sabrina. And so that's going to start on my lash line and go all the way up to my brow. Okay. So Sabrina again, let's do the same thing on both sides. I'm gonna show you why this brush is so amazing. You're gonna see in like two minutes here. Okay, so Sabrina's everywhere first and you're gonna put it in the center of your eye eyelid and I'm using the smaller end so that it gives it a little more um, pop, okay? Same thing on the other eye. Okay, just stick with me. It's gonna it's gonna look so good. Okay, next I'm gonna use bird and I'm gonna go just on the outer third of the eye. And I'm helping there look like a crease. So my eyes are kind of getting a little hooded, so I'm just getting a little bit more dimension here to my eye with every step that I'm taking. Hi. Mom, I mom, I did this to you. Thank you for bringing those back. You're so helpful, Jaina. Yeah. She did. Thanks for that. Okay. Oh, and Scarlet's got it again. Okay, then we're going to finish with Trust, which is a little bit of a darker color. Again, stick into the outer third of the eye. Bring it up a bit there. And then bring it underneath. Uh-oh. Okay. And now once you've done that, you're going to flip your brush over and you're just going to blend it so it's all just 
goes together so smoothly. It's crazy to think, I had no idea you could blend your eyeshadows <laughs> to make them look good together, but they go on, they look just like the makeup where it looks kind of like, eh, you're not sure if it's gonna work, and then they just blend together so perfectly. Okay, the last step for my eyes that I like to do um, always is I like to add a pop of shimmer. So I'm gonna take my Georgia Illuminator, which is the same thing that I have on my cheeks here. I'm gonna take that eyeshadow brush, and I'm gonna take it right up here. Let's see what my baby's doing. And I'm also gonna take a teeny bit right in the corner of my eye. I love adding a little pop of shimmer right there to really brighten things up. that's so pretty and so easy like it's so easy you guys okay now I'm just gonna <laughs> is your hand stuck again yeah you keep putting your hand in there yeah <laughs> okay I'm gonna finish off my look with this beautiful cream eyeliner. It's called Black Friday. I'm gonna use my multitasker brush again. And depending on how thick you want it, you make it work for you. Isn't that go? Cool? Doesn't that go on so nice though? It's so quick, so easy. And it comes in like a little square like this, but you guys, it's gonna last you for like the rest of your life. It's gonna last forever. You can use a hotline brush for this if you prefer that. I prefer the multitasker. Whoops. Look at the difference though. Isn't that just incredible? teeny little bit of eyeliner it's amazing all right last I am gonna line the bottom today just for fun I never I very rarely actually line the bottom but we all know it does add right look at that okay I'm gonna go and I'm gonna put my mascara on and then I'm gonna come back and show you the finished look <laughs> 